Hello, welcome to another math lesson for data management. My name is Mr. King and uh, we're going to do a very simple linear regression using Fathom software. It is actually very easy to learn and all I'm going to do is I'm going to first do a scatter plot of two variables. And all I'm going to do is call them x and y, but they don't have to be they don't have to be called x and y. I could call it frequency, for example on the y-axis. Now to change frequency, maybe I want to change it back to y again, I hit control Z and I can retype. Well, okay, I'm just going to do the simplest plot imaginable. Uh, just the numbers in sequence, a uh, bunch of numbers in sequence. And um, <clears throat> now this is uh, this is my regression. Now to uh, make these into ordered pairs on a graph for my scatter plot, I take um, well, let's do let's just hit the delete key and do that again. I go up to where uh, this graph icon is. I move my arrow over it, and notice there's a tooltip that says new graph. Well, I click and drag that icon and notice there's a, a dotted um, a dotted uh, line uh, indicating that there's going to be a, a, a window open and this is actually a um, this is actually the graph that we're going to plot now the x goes on the x-axis for my scatter plot the y goes on the y-axis and notice we have now uh, both um, both x and y coordinates for each uh, for each point and if I click on the points notice the corresponding ordered pair uh, is highlighted in um, the spreadsheet marked collection one uh, to your left so what I have here is a scatter plot and really if I want to actually do a, a regression line there's two ways to do it I can kind of BS my way through it there's this thing called a movable line which you're not going to be very happy with but I know some teachers that like to do this just to teach people the concept of the um, line of best fit and certainly notice that you do have to manually play with it a bit to get this to kind of match up so I was just moving that line around it was you know some other way it was some other orientation but I don't want that um, I, I don't want uh, that sort of thing instead I'm going to for my scatter plot um, just do this again it doesn't take long to plot all my points fortunately and uh, instead what I want is a least squares line and that's famously known as the regression line as you know from your lessons in advan in um, data management this is y equals negative x plus 10 so that's the line y equals negative x plus 10 and you notice down here it says r squared equals 1 well if you take the square root of both sides you actually get Pearson's r and Pearson's r is 1 uh, it should actually be minus 1 indicating a perfect negative correlation and um, so there you go there's your line there's your regression line and um, you could actually plot as many points as you like that table could go down as far as you want all I did was plot nine points but you could plot 30 40 50 100 plot as many as to your heart's content and fathom will take it okay that's it uh, for this 